Right, yo, what's going on guys? Jake Daly here, and today I'm bringing you a little sort of ranty sort of video. Uh, first off, I'm just gonna start off with this video. Um, I'm just gonna just show a little clip of it. Uh, basically, one of my friends, Blair, he hit a sort of like CS clip, and I was like, oh, nice shot, and he was like, oh, can I please be in the video? Can you do a phase edit to it? So I've done a little edit, and uh, in the video I actually ask him, have you got any song requests? And he says, anything to do with Megan Trainer because I know you don't like her. And I put a little... I don't here. Hang on. I don't. There we go. End my suffering with my words after that. The main topic of this video, I'm going to be talking about the infamous song, Dear Future Husband. The lyrics of this song. This song actually, it physically hurts me. Just look at her fucking face in this. That just, that aggravates me. That actually physically fucking hurts me. First off, I'm not being funny. The sheer amount of fucking makeup caked on her face in this video. She shouldn't be trying to narrow down her future husband. She should be fucking taking what she can get. What is she wearing in that clip? Let's just fast forward a little bit. What is that outfit? What the fuck? I'm not the fucking fashion police, but what the fuck is she wearing in this? Right, so from the music video, that little fail there, because he wasn't strong enough to be her husband. He wasn't muscly enough. Sorry, but I take that offensive because I'm not the fucking strongest person. As you can probably see from my fucking arms in my videos, I'm not a fucking muscly person. So what was she doing on the floor here? What is she doing? Who cleans the floor whilst laying on the floor fucking rubbing herself all up it? Is that what turns her on? Is that fetish of hers? Ungrateful. A fucking a little African boy with a little bloated belly would have done anything for that little meal and she's fucking nah I ain't having it no not good enough for me not good enough for me something I noticed whilst editing this video the similarities did I read that lyric right hang on let me try and find it on this disgusting song hang on a noble never see your family more than mine what so that means if I'm with you I'm not allowed to see my family <laughs> what Let's just have a little read of some of these lyrics, shall we? One thing that I really love about this song is she is sitting there, she's outlining everything she wants in a man, and then she's like, if you treat me right, I'll be your perfect wife, buying groceries. So I've got to be strong, I've got to be a number of other things on this long fucking winded song, and in return, for treating her perfectly, doing everything she wants, she'll buy me fucking groceries. She'll go out to fucking Tesco's, Probably fucking Aldi, knowing her. Because if you look at her, she looks like a sort of person that shops at Aldi, doesn't she? Even when I'm acting crazy, tell me everything's alright. What, so when you're being an absolute fucking cunt to me, I've got to say, oh no, it's alright. She's hitting you repeatedly, pushing you up against the wall, hitting you. She's acting a bit fucking crazy, she's screaming at you. Megan, everything's okay, it's fine. Hit me more, please. After every fight, just apologise. And maybe then I'll let you try and rock my body right. You can have an argument. She could cheat on you. And you can have an argument about it. But as long as you apologise, you have the liberty of having her back. How how generous of her. How absolute fucking beautifully generous of her to do that for you. What a, what a great woman. What a great woman. Even if I was wrong, laugh. You know I'm never wrong. Let's just, let's have a little look at her laughing. What was that little dance there? Can we just pause and just think about that little dance? What was she doing? Was that her sort of adapted version of twerking? <laughs> what was that laugh? What was that? What was that? Right, this is one line that really just, this bugs me a little bit. I'll be sleeping on the left side of the bed. Open doors for me and you might get some kisses. It was quite fucking clear she meant head. Bed, head, it rhymes. If you want to get that special loving tonight, tell me I'm beautiful. Each and every night. <laughs> anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this little sort of like rant video. Whenever this song comes on at work, it sort of, it really just fucking gets to me. It, I literally, I walk upstairs, I have to get away from the fucking music. Oh, what is that fucking smile? Ugh. Ugh. Oh, no, 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 no. Getting off of that. Getting off of that. End my suffering is a prominent fucking phrase here. Anyway guys, I hope you did enjoy this little transition there, uh, but I hope you did enjoy this. As I say, this song does actually bug me so, so much. If you want me to make more of these, give some suggestions maybe, uh, just let me know what you guys think, and I'll see you guys in the next video.